Deepavali celebration of lights and happiness all around the city. In Deepavali, small children create forts and worship them in the memory of Shri Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj. We decorate our house with various flowers and beautiful diyas all around our house. It's really magical to watch these lanterns flying in the air during the Diwali nights. Lanterns in the balcony all around our houses and it's really a beautiful treat to watch these colors in lanterns glowing all around our houses. So, Deepavali starts with Vasubharas, where we offer our prayers to the mother cow. Second day of Diwali starts with the prayers offered to the god Tanvantari, who is also the god of medicines. Deepavali is all about waking up early in the morning and doing Abhyanga Snana. It's all about preparations for the prayers that will be offered. Farad, which is nothing but a collection of snacks that is Shuda, Chakali, Anar. They are offered as a prayer to gods and to the guests who will come or drop in at the home during the time of Diwali. It is also distributed to the neighbors. Rangoli, it cannot be separated from the Diwali. It really graces the entrance of every household during the Diwali. It is really a treat to watch the streets of India during the Diwali. They are filled with flowers, decorations and firecrackers all around. And in the evening, we offer our prayers to the goddess Lakshmi. And goddess places us with prosperity and stability. And on the evening of Lakshmi Puja, we really light up the sky using various firecrackers. The next day, our marks the Bhai Puj, the celebration where sister offers prayer to her brother and wishes him his long life and prosperity. It is really a treat to watch children enjoy during Diwali. Some enjoy it by firecrackers, some enjoy it with bubbles nowadays. And then comes the ceremony of Tulsi Viva, where prayers are offered to Goddess Tulsi. Thank you so much for watching my first ever Diwali compilation.